Welcome to Mishnah Sari Masechet Tanit Perek Bet Mishnah Yod. Over here is Mishnah Les Mishnah Des Perek. We're going to speak about fasting on Rosh Chodesh, Hanukkah, and Purim. Um, preferably not to. So, En Gozrim Tanit Al Tzibur. We go, again. We don't start. We we're not gozer a uh, fast day on the public. But Rosh Chodeshim, Nan Rosh Chodesh, Hanukkah, or Purim, Nan on Hanukkah, Nan on Purim. We mitchilu En Mafsikim. If they started. You don't stop. Meaning, if you started the series and then one of them fell out of Rosh Chodesh, then you're not going to stop. You're going to continue and you're going to uh, finish the fast. Now, I'm going to be my ear. Comes to be me. Says, even though Rabban Gamil said, if you start, you don't you don't stop. Right? Meaning, you're going to continue the series and you're going to fast on that day. He would agree that you don't complete the fast all the way till sunset. You'll eat towards the end of the day, so you don't stay the whole day in a fast. That's what a bimir says. Allah has not like a bimir. V'chen tisha be'av, similarly tisha be'av, shechaliot erev Shabbat. If tisha be'av fell on a Friday, same thing, right? We don't want you to go into Shabbat um, fasting, so we tell you to eat a little before um, before Shabbat, so you don't you're not fasting the entire day on a uh, on a, on a Friday. On, on Tisha B'Av Friday. And again, Halakha is not like this. Rather, you would finish off the day. And parenthetically, the um, Friday Tisha B'Av really doesn't fall out today with an hour calendar, the way it's set up. This would really only be happen um, if there was still being a Kadesh Tachodesh based on when they saw the moon. Uh, but today with this calendar, we never have a uh, Friday Tisha B'Av.